welcome to Kerala. The pride and joy of the tourism ministry open any travel brochure and you'll see beautiful images like the ones we've just shown you of lush greenery, magnificent beaches, serene backwaters. But as we've traveled down Kerala's coastline, we found that there's a lot more than this than meets the eye. In Cochin, for example, Chinese fishnets in use for over 500 years and a huge tourist draw are vanishing from Cochin's coastline. Rising maintenance costs and a poor catch are forcing these fishermen into unusual means of survival. A centuries-old practice now at the mercy of the generosity of tourists. The Chinese fishing net, or a chinawala as it is known in Malayalam, is unique, for it is one that is operated from shore. Where they're from? From China? I don't know. Fishing nets? Where are they from? Kerala? <laughs> to be honest, I, I actually don't know that yet. It may not be well known, but these fishermen might well be the beneficiaries of one of the oldest surviving legacies of the Indo-Chinese economic relationship. Chinese fishing nets are believed to have been brought to the Malabar coast from China between four and 500 years ago. According to some accounts, they were brought by Mongolian traders from the court of the great Kublai Khan in the 14th century. Others claim they were introduced by the Chinese navigator Cheng Ho when he stopped in Kerala on his way to the Arabian Peninsula. But this ancient old fishing technique is now under threat. Presently, there are only 11 Chinese fishing nets dotting the Fort Kochi shoreline, almost half the number that existed a decade ago. In the case of these fishing nets, unlike many other traditional forms of coast-based livelihood, tourism has come to the rescue. Well, I thought they were actually, it was their livelihood. I was a bit surprised to see that they are relying on uh, tourists to make their livelihood, but we are quite happy to contribute to that. Although economic growth has resulted in the replacement of older production techniques with newer ones since the dawn of humankind, what is troubling here is that it's environmental degradation and not technological progress that's making these nets unviable. To that extent, their story is a grim indicator of the unintended effects of rapid man-made change on the environment. NDTV's Cricket app, Android and iPhone. Faster scorecard, special analysis, and much more. Download free. NDTV.com slash apps.